Hello folks, and welcome back to a new Let's Play. This one of a personal favorite of mine that was made back in 1997. I got to look right alongside uh, two of my other favorite PlayStation 2, 1 games. Uh, them being Breath of Fire 3 and Final Fantasy 7. This is the Top Down Adventure by Working Designs, Alundra. Well, let's get right into it, shall we? I will be playing this on my PS3. As, you know, PS2 can't be captured by Hogpog for some reason. I don't know. It's technical stuff I'll probably never get used to. It's just going to be funky because I'll be wanting to use the analog sticks. And this game does not support analog stick. Hmm. That's a nice ship. That's a pretty elfy looking captain. I wonder who else is an elf in this game. Oh yeah. Probably me. That's me. I can jump. I can swing a sword. I can dash. Don't even need Pegasus. Pegasus boots. And then my circle button does nothing yet. My R2 button brings up my menu, so does my start button. And, of course, diagonals move me around. Uh, yeah, kind of, actually. <laughs> wow, I'm a for forgetful guy. I got a dagger. Is that like a cutlass? Well, should stop looking at them then. Yeah. I'll miss dry land too. That sucks. Um, reasons. Something about nightmares, I guess. So, fun fact I have not actually beaten this game. Yeah. I've had this game for nearly crap <laughs> for a good 17 years or so. 16, maybe. I don't know. In this beginning part, you pretty much just have to talk to everyone. Wait. No, let me pass. Let a guy through. Uh, yeah. I, I guess I am. Um, ever had really freaky nightmares? Yeah, that's why. But yeah, I've never beaten this game before. So I'm really hoping that the doing this as a Let's Play is a really better, much better incentive to beating this game. Nightmares. It's probably on fire in my nightmares. Yeah, get the fix in it. Your dick. You know what? Fine. I'll break all your crates. Uh. Uh. Health. Yeah, you can pretty much jump on most everything in this game. Including on top of people's heads. Just thought I'd share that. Let's go talk to the captain. He's probably not busy at all being a captain or anything. Not busy at all being the captain and all that. What's up, Captain? You don't have pointy ears at all. Yep, really bad dreams. Port is near, yay. I'm gonna go bother the captain some more. Tee hee hee. Why? I'm just standing here, staring at you. Why should we go lay down? You just said we were probably coming into port. Ah, whatever. Every one of these sailors is a bag of beef. Oh well. 
guess I'll just go to sleep. Ah, sweet, sweet dreams. Okay, it's not going to be as sweet as I think it is, is it? A resounding nope. Yes, I can hear you. Stop asking. Well, don't you look imposing. And no, I cannot control the speed of this text. You will read it. You will read it for all the plot. This entire scene pretty much just plays out on its own, by the way. Oh, hey, this must be the village of Anoa. Looks peaceful enough, except for that sinister scream and this really sinister sounding music. Gonna kind of think of it, it doesn't sound all that peaceful anymore. Do we have to go to Anoa? Is that where the plot has to take place? To take place? Anywhere else? Like, I think the only two places that I think I would not go besides here is Silent Hill or that place where Fatal Frame takes place. In that whole shrine temple place. Yes, my lord, I can freaking hear you. I must be really tired after a thousand years. Oh, look over here. Whoa. Talk about menacing. I'm not that miserable. Besides, I'm obviously an elf. Did you not see the intro movie? He's got a point there. Uh -huh. Your reality. So whose reality is this really? I kind of wish they had a snickering noise from the old man. I didn't hear a snicker. I mean, to be fair, Melzas is pretty tall dude there, Lars. Could probably kick my butt. Oh, that's a lazy excuse there, Melza. You know, I'm gonna get like halfway through this game and then they'll po finally pop back on to the whole, ooh, here's the plot thing. And I'm gonna be like, who are these guys again? Oh, right. I've had great power. I think I have a charge attack, actually. I can dash. Blarg, you're dead. Whoa. That's a big tree behind you. Oddly placed, though. And then the world, it is destiny. Well, that wasn't that bad of a dream. I don't think anyone thing could go wrong. Okay, as you can see by the way, shaking this also affects how you move. How oh, lovely. The storm has jammed my door. Well, I guess it's a good thing that those sailors are pretty lazy. I don't see this as a good thing anymore. Then why aren't we through this storm yet? Yeah, the sea is no threat whatsoever. 
that reef over there on the other hand, that might be a little bit more of a problem. Like, render your ship into sort of problems. Ugh. Well, no one survived that crash. Game over. Next one. Nah, it wouldn't be that simple now, would it? Of course, the mighty hero is destined to live. Yeah, we'll call it destiny. Or, you know, plot. Plot, plot, plot. This game's got a lot more plot than the old Legend Zeldas of the time. Except for maybe Ocarina. I don't know. Uh, what did I drink last night? Yeah, I guess this guy's name is Jess. Yeah, that would suck. Well, I guess we really... Oh, excuse me. I guess we really know that this guy's name is Jess. Ooh, can he make me a great sword? Nice to meet you too, Jess. You sound like a pretty cool guy. Yeah, actually, why? Uh, not really. Well, that's kind of depressing. Every one of those guys is dead now. Uh, can I sleep a little bit longer? Oh, cool. Cause that's not depressing there, Jess. Ooh, special diary. Yeah, I suppose, uh, suppose that would be a little rep repetitive. You should really have, you know, changed it up by saying, I made a great sword today. I made a shamshir today. I made a cutlass. I don't know. So as you can tell, these journals are actually save points. They're pretty much in the middle of any big things that happen in the game. Do, 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 do. Oh, nothing in there. Pew, oh. Pew. <laughs> uh, running into walls. It's fun. You know what? I like his hospitality and all. Take this, pot! Hey, uh, Jess, what are you doing? Really? You want me to talk to everyone in the village? Everyone in this tiny ass village? Well, as long as I can have it, what's in this treasure chest? Damn it. You cock blocked me, game. Well, as you can see, we got the basic sort of system of this button's going to be my sword, this button's going to be my special kind of a imagey sort of showing of health there, and what will be Gilder at the top right over there. Those catchers is just uh, weapons are art. Know what I'm saying? Why do I feel like you're re related to, um, Fujin? Was it Fujin? No, it's Raijin. Uh, alright, just keep your thing about special juices to yourself. Alright, I'm gonna end this video here, and hopefully you guys will enjoy this Let's Play because, you know, I love this game. So, there's gonna be a lot more videos of this coming through. I will see you guys in the next video. Cheers.